Marshall? Marshall! You're alive! It's Marshall? Wait, it's Jesse! The director! Was Marshall corrupted by the hiss? Is she the one that's able to do this? Create those crystals? hotline so that person couldn't have been Marshall right one problem at a time let's see what's going on with that pillar first investigate the nail okay we don't have any new abilities can't upgrade that I want to see what's over here. Guess I can keep recycling these. Okay, I could deconstruct even though I'm not on that weapon, eh? Nine thousand. Wait, did I miss something? I didn't look very closely. God, this is so cool. The nail. It's been five days since we first entered the building. Traversing the interior is dangerous due to the shifting. But we did manage to find a lower cavern that seems structurally predictable. They said it doesn't shift. Which is a scientific way of saying its walls won't crush us in our sleep. Northmore even made a discovery. A pistol placed on a stone pedestal in front of that strange ebony pillar. Oh. Seems like something out of a storybook, except the heroes usually find swords, not handguns. But it is the perfect lure for someone like him. Hours after finding this weapon, Northmore cornered me as about some nonsense about how the board had made him the director. This is where they found the gun, maybe? He about the title being meaningless before now, calling Father and all other previous directors shams, frauds, and worse. I think this place is worse for Northmore than it is for me. Strangest thing? There was no pedestal in front of that pillar a day ago. This building has swallowed a dozen of my men, and now it's handing out presents? Is it playing some sort of game? If it is, we're most certainly losing. Hell, we don't even know the rules. Interesting. We're getting pieces, but the puzzle remains a mystery. The nail door monolith is hurt. Touch, revere it to enter. Touch the straight. Wait, 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 wait. What's this over here? Before we just touch random shit, maybe we should read up. On the nature of the pillar, the pillar found in the crossroads is best described as an onyx spike that protrudes from the cave floor like an imposing stalagmite. From the floor, mite, small. From the floor, down below. It's actually kind of a weird mnemonic, but it works for me for some reason. Despite its aggressive silhouette, the structure has an undeniable allure. Freud would certainly have something to say about the pillar's overly erect nature. But I'm more drawn to Whitmore's essay on dynamic layers. Structures within structures, the fractal mirror in every being. 
Given its significant location, I believe the pillar is either the very heart of the oldest house or an intrusion within that heart. Or perhaps it's like the husk of a seed from which the oldest house sprouted. Trottier wrote that, or Tr Trottier wrote that great architecture isn't built. I don't know if that's a French name or not. It grows. But then why does the pillar look so different from the rest of this place's concrete walls and rocky caverns? Easier to see it as an anomaly, a buried artifact, a foreign body, a demonic phallus. I wonder if this pillar is any more welcome here than we are. By Dr. Theodore Ash, head of research. It sounds like... This is, this is where they got the gun that we're using. And Northmore was the first one to get it. Kind of looks like an, an eye. People all around it. It also kind of looks like a spider, spidery thing. Or those could be mountains, but they look like legs. Six legs, though. Not a spider. Creepy! That's fun. That's fun to shoot. So this is going to give us uh, some way to get fly up higher, I think. Because how else would we get up there? Let's check it out. Actually, hold on. I want to I check. This is kind of like the foundation we're used to seeing. Oh, looks like we can go down there. Okay, maybe that's the place to go next, or is it secrets? Okay, I didn't want to fall down unless there was something there. Let's go. Repair the nail slash link to prevent astral com consumption slash collision. This is the director's duty slash plot. Authorize for a single new tool slash upgrade. Use it to save the foundation slash us slash bureau. So the actual plane challenge. Left self or right weapon. Only one is permitted. Which will you choose slash become? So I can only choose one? <laughs> I thought I was done with these tests. Self or weapon? Choose the actual plane challenge. Shape manipulate. Yes. Fracture undo. So you can either destroy them or we can create them. That seems way cooler. We are tweaking slash cultivating the ability slash you. <laughs> Minerals, roots, barnacles grow across the foundation. Use the new upgrade slash self to shape inflate. First director to receive slash earn this should feel honored slash handled. <laughs> hey, definitely feel handled. So that's how we get to those spots. 
It's not that we can fly higher, it's that we can manipulate these crystals. Which appears to be what Marshall, his Marshall, was doing. Crumble after being shaped, some of them. I'm so curious to find out what uh, you all chose. I have a feeling the one that I just chose is more popular because of what we've seen. Although there was way, one way that we had we maybe had to destroy them to be able to proceed. Right? There was that one formation that, that blocked our way. And I guess that changes what you find or how you traverse. It's meant to loosen the four locks, keys, MacGuffins located in the fringe nowhere of the astral plane. Astral bleeding slash collision has spread slash lost them. Do this and nail will be repaired slash glued slash crisis averted. P.S. Bonus round. His are present in Foundation. Trespassing slash snooping is forbidden. Huh? Okay. Some crystals can be shaped into dangerously sharp points. Oh, like traps. Cool. Spin grouping efficiency. Is it better? Hmm, this is interesting. Uh, I kind of like swapping in between though, like going, using up all my ammo and then switching to energy, like throw and stuff like that. Getting more energy back is not big of a deal. Whistles can be shaped while well, levitating to create platforms. Okay. So when I was asking about, can you like jump off of stuff that you throw? Kind of. Uh, well levitating. Something and now the astral plane is bleeding into the foundation, which will destroy the oldest house, the bureau, and everyone inside. I need to find four locks or keys or whatever to stop that from happening. But I'm the director, I've handled worse. This should be simple ish. You with me? Got it. Base camp. Let's go this way first. <sighs> Elemental source gain. That's new, isn't it? Energy gain from taking melee damage can cost to energy recovery. Source gained per element pickup, plus four. Hmm. Hmm. We're looking to get source, aren't we? I'm sure I'll have enough to upgrade sooner rather than later. Right. Yeah. 
Secrets? Secrets? Secrets! Maybe. From the desk of Director Northmoor to all Foundation personnel, it has come to my attention that members of our exploration teams have been relieving themselves of their god-given liquids in the chasms of the Foundation. As per earlier orders, all personnel in currently serving in the Foundation must expel fluid slash urinate slash do their business. He's talking like the freaking... Uh, <laughs> he's talking like the board. Uh, exclusively into the correctly colored and labeled vials provided by research personnel. To do otherwise disrupts the ongoing study of the Foundation and demonstrates profound disrespect not only for the board and its oldest house, but also for the Bureau you so proudly serve. If I discover firsthand any agents treating the Oblivion as their personal lavatory, they will be forced to go down there and personally clean up their mess. Sign Director Broderick Northmore. Broderick. Rituals. Box keys keep socket slash us here. Trap hooked, hidden fed. They are old slash young slash extra life. With the director's help. Situation slash information is subject to change. Extra lives. It is secret. Yes. Secret. Ah! Ah! Oh. My God, that scared the shit out of me. <laughs> well played, Remedy. You got me. Boy, dark in some of these areas, eh? Just goes on forever. Also reminds me a bit of Lord of the Rings. Interesting. This looks suspicious. No? Look like I could maybe destroy that. I'm confused. I thought there was supposed to be something down here. That looks so fucking suspicious. Maybe with if we took the weapon, it would destroy that. Wait, is there a light up there? There is. Okay. Okay. Is there a... No, I don't see... I don't see any crystals that can be manipulated. Oh yeah, okay.
Ah, it's from up there. Okay, got it. Wacky game. This game, by the way, is a lot more serious than uh, Alan Wake. Alan Wake is like at least half goofy. <laughs> it's it's got a totally like it's still dark, and there are definitely some serious moments to it. But like it, the dialogue and the, the characters are fucking goofy. Shooting them? Oh, cool. Oh, this is neat. Okay. Just look down here for a second. This is gonna. I don't know if. Let's just go up here. We'll get that first. Where is this going? East camp. Let's check over here first. That, uh, that, like, slicing attack, was spinning slicing attack is pretty nasty. Uh-oh. Good call. Evade ammo refund. Hmm. 8% ammo recovery on evade use. That's kind of neat. Um, think about it. Honestly, I don't need to like. I feel like I have to think too hard about it. This looks kind of like that wall that we saw before that it, where it looks breakable, but it probably isn't. Want you, friend? Follow me, my friend. We shall conquer the world together. Or you could stay there. That works too. Sucks. I'm not sure about that gun, guys. Uh oh. Ow!
What's happening? Where am I? Where did I go? Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Oh, God. That guy's dead. I don't remember killing him, but okay. I don't know if I like spin. I think I prefer uh, my sniper gun. But, you know, it's new. So it's fun. So it's fun to play with something new. Melee source gained. Order. Oh, okay. I was kind of hoping, yeah, it does order it by um, how powerful they are, too. Is that a new one? Wow, I've got a lot of jukebox tokens, which I think I'm going to save for a live stream to finish off the game will do some of those excursions. After gaining the shape ability, Jesse is able to access remote areas of the foundation. Okay. As we expected. Not check out this way. Oh, this just goes back to secrets. Oh no, I can't get these because I can't destroy it. And I can't manipulate these ones either. Son of a bitch. Do we get the gun too at some point? Don't answer that. We'll find out. Secrets though. Although I didn't say that it was a secret, did it? So I don't know if we count that, but I just like to say secret. from the upper floors oh hi you know i was like wait where's the power source to open that but this guy just uh opened the way for me oh okay that's to get the power source nothing else in here Complete the ritual in the collapsed apartment. Complete the ritual. There's something behind that his barrier. below me, right? What? You're not supposed to be here. Just trying stuff out. Everyone relax. Not gonna destroy the pretty kitty. Well, I would have destroyed it. 
I was trying to destroy it. Who am I? Who am I trying to kid? I think I'm gonna need to jump up to that other side. I think I would have been able to do this without the the crystal pole, I guess. Reach the warehouse path. Complete the ritual in the class department. Wait a second. Data entry and filing. Five ability points. Damage. See, we're getting close. I only need like uh, three thousand. What I would get hundreds to say. Something like that. Shift account part one. To whoever finds this, I am containment processor designer uh, Gene Gibbs or Jean. And I'm writing Jean. And I'm writing this to document the largest building shift to ever occur. Here are the facts. A considerably large section of the containment sector, including the processes and protocols offices, our research facilities, and a fair chunk of the fire break, has been yanked down to a chasm that reaches far below lobby level, I think. It was a violent shift, and I regret to report several casualties. Injuries were sustained by all, but many of us, myself included, are still mobile. We set up a base camp and started triaging. There are, there are little supplies. We explored our surroundings and found caverns of all things. Not of all things. A cavern found caverns of all things. It's just like, you found all the things in the caverns? Maybe we're in some kind of cave. Threshold like the quarry? Wherever we are, we're not the first. There were some rusty power cores, old lights, signs, infrastructure. What was this area used for? Why did they seal it off? Why have we never heard of it? More importantly, how are we going to get out? So they sealed it off. Uh, Northmore, I guess, decided to. And it was just rediscovered by these people by accident because of the shift. I think this is the way we're supposed to go, right? Kiev. AWE 37 0813 2011. A series of reverberating sounds observed in downtown Kiev with no clear point of origin. The event was witnessed by the city's general public. Mental and physical symptoms were reported, including aphasia, sleep paralysis, and excess redacted. <laughs> Everything got redacted! All the papers! <laughs> In the reported individuals. Oh, sorry, 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 sorry. The re individuals were redacted. Due to the brief nature of the event, pardon me, overseas bureau agents were not able to respond while it was active. Immediately upon arrival, agents collected audio recordings taken by local witnesses. All bureau monitoring stations located at global junctions of acoustic amplification were directed to monitor any auditory events of similar pitch, wavelength, and duration in an effort to trace echoes or epicenters. Huh. Could be kind of hissy. In the following week, similar cases were reported from both various amateur sources and bureau stations in major cities across the globe. The subsequent events diminished in volume and frequency per each occurrence. Believed to be generated by planar friction. 
So this is not confirmed. Maybe not. Maybe I'm looking, looking too much into it. Trying to connect things where they're not connected. Ooh, I definitely do that. Plus 9%, 90% energy. I could do that instead of the launch energy cost. I think we're changing it up, everybody. Just an overall plus 19% energy. 